everybody. Our final half term story for this week is Cave Baby by Julia Donaldson and Emily Gravett. Cave Baby's lucky. He lives inside a cave with his mum who's good at painting and his dad who's very brave and a sabre-toothed tiger, a hyena and a hare, and a grey woolly mammoth, and a big brown bear. Cave Baby's lonely. Nobody will play. Dad is busy being brave. Mum says, keep away. Everything is boring. Then suddenly it's not. For in a corner of the cave, he finds a brush and pot. Spots on the hyena, stripes on the hare, stars on the tiger, squiggles on the bear, zigzags on the mammoth. This is lots of fun! But Mum and Dad are furious and say, Look what he's done! Cave Mum fetches water. She mutters and she wipes. No more spots and squiggles. No more stars and stripes. Cave Dad wags his finger. If you don't take care, a mammoth's going to throw you to the big brown bear. Cave Baby's restless. He's feeling wide awake. A long grey trunk comes sneaking in, all wiggly like a snake. Where are you taking me? Where? Tell me where. Are you going to throw me to the big brown bear? Stripes in the forest. A tiger's looking there. Don't throw me to the tiger or the big brown bear. Crashing in the bushes, a hare is leaping there. Maybe he's escaping from the big brown bear. A cackle in the bracken, a hyena's laughing there. He Has he heard a joke about the big brown bear? A cave in the hillside. I wonder who lives there. I hope it's not. Don't let it be the big brown bear. The cave is bright with moonlight. The walls are plain and bare. Snoring in the shadows. Someone's sleeping there. Cave baby's worried. He doesn't understand. Until the woolly mammoth pops a paintbrush in his hand. A five-legged tiger. A long curly hair. Horns and a hyena, a beard on a bear, a moustache on a mammoth. This is lots of fun. Then the mammoth wakes his family and says, look what he's done. And they rollick and they frolic, they trumpet and they crash. They wade into the water, they roll and romp and splash. They shake the baby by the hand, then lift their trunks and wave as the mammoth picks him up again and takes him to his cave. Cave baby's happy. He's fast asleep in bed. 
He dreams about a tiger with stripes of pink and red and a grass green hyena and a sky blue hare and a moon yellow mammoth and a small brown bear. The end. I hope you've enjoyed these stories this week and I hope you've had a lovely break. Take care everybody and I will see you again soon. Bye.